Hey everyone, so today we're just going to do some uh, chronograph testing of the um, 50 Beowulf. Uh, we shortened it down to uh, about 7.5 inches from the 10.5 inch that I had before. And we're just going to do some chronograph testing. Um, this is it, folded, kind of looks like a pistol. And this is it. There's an SBR. Not bad, looks like everything came together pretty well. Alright, so just stay tuned for the uh, chronograph test results. And um, tell me what you think. Okay, we're going to start off uh, shooting the 330, 335 uh, grain hollow points. And uh, there's a chronograph. Let's take a look at what we're getting here. Sixteen thirty four, fifteen seventy seven, fifteen twenty four. 1569 and we're out so we're averaging between uh, 15 to 1600 feet per second just like what I expected um, probably same kind of uh, velocity energy like the 500 Smith & Wesson Magnum out of an AR style platform that's great. Okay, guys, exactly. so we're now going to be testing out the uh, 400 grain uh, hawk. Kind of give you an idea what it looks like. Big old chunk of lead. Okay. We're going to see how well that performs uh, out of the 7.5 inch uh, 50 Beowulf SBR. Uh, yeah. Shot a string of three. Let's go ahead and see what we get. Fourteen thirty three, fourteen fifty six. So we're getting uh, right in the uh, fourteen hundred. So looking at about, uh, let's say, hundred feet per second difference. Okay, that kind of like messed my shoulder up a little bit, but <laughs> let's wait till that uh, eases up. So. Thought about um, calculations were about right. All right, well, that kind of gives you all an idea. I think I'll just save that other shot for another day. Uh, thanks again for watching.